The Sun, a giant ball of burning gas. It's the reason we have life on Earth. The Sun provides us with light and warmth. Without the Sun, our planet would be a frozen wasteland. Right now, the Sun is happily fusing hydrogen into helium. This process releases enormous amounts of energy. This energy is what makes the Sun shine. But the Sun won't be like this forever. Like all stars, the Sun has a life cycle. Eventually, the Sun will run out of fuel. When this happens, it will undergo some dramatic changes. These changes will have a big impact on the Earth. But don't worry, this won't happen for billions of years. For now, the Sun is stable and continues to support life on Earth. Its energy drives our climate and weather, making Earth a habitable planet. The Sun's energy is harnessed by plants for photosynthesis and by humans for solar power. The Sun's magnetic field and solar wind also protect us from cosmic radiation. So let's appreciate our local star and the life it sustains. In about 5 billion years, the Sun will start to change. It will have used up most of the hydrogen in its core. As the hydrogen runs out, the Sun's core will shrink. This shrinkage will cause the core to heat up even more. This intense heat will cause the Sun's outer layers to expand. The Sun will grow much larger. It will become a red giant. As a red giant, the Sun will engulf Mercury and Venus. The Earth will be scorched. Our planet will no longer be habitable. The Sun will then start fusing helium in its core. Eventually, it will shed its outer layers, creating a planetary nebula. The remaining core will become a white dwarf. The outer planets will drift away and the solar system will be forever changed. After its red giant phase, the Sun will become unstable. It will start to pulsate. These pulsations will push the Sun's outer layers away. The outer layers will form a beautiful cloud of gas and dust. This cloud is called a planetary nebula. At the center of this nebula, the Sun's core will remain. The core will be small and incredibly dense. It will be about the size of Earth. This hot, dense core is called a white dwarf. The white dwarf will shine brightly, slowly cooling over billions of years. Eventually, the planetary nebula will fade, leaving the white dwarf behind. Some stars end their lives as black holes. Black holes are regions of space-time where gravity is so strong that nothing, not even light, can escape. But the Sun is not massive enough to become a black hole. It will never have enough gravity to crush itself into that state. Instead, the Sun will slowly cool down over trillions of years. The white dwarf will eventually fade away. It will become a cold, dark object known as a black dwarf. The Sun's death will mark the end of our solar system. But for now, we can enjoy the Sun's warmth and light. We have billions of years left before we need to worry about the Sun's demise. Eventually, the Black Dwarf will cool to the temperature of the cosmic microwave background. The Sun's influence extends beyond just providing light and warmth. It governs the orbits of all the planets in our solar system. The Sun's gravity keeps the planets in their paths, and its solar wind shapes the space environment. Without the Sun, the solar system as we know it would not exist. The Sun is more than just a star. It's the heartbeat of our solar system. Throughout history, the Sun has been central in many cultures and religions. Ancient civilizations worshipped the Sun as a god, inspiring countless myths and legends. The Sun's cycles influenced agricultural practices and timekeeping, from the Egyptians who revered Ra to the Aztecs who honored Huitzilopochtli. The Sun has always been more than just a celestial body. It symbolizes life, power, and rebirth. The Greek god Helios and the Japanese sun goddess Amaterasu are examples of the sun's personification across cultures. The sun's influence extends beyond mythology. Its cycles were crucial in developing agriculture. Ancient farmers relied on the sun for planting and harvesting. The solar calendar tracks Earth's orbit around the sun, aiding timekeeping and societal organization. Today, the sun inspires art, literature, and music. Its imagery evokes warmth, hope, and renewal. As we explore the cosmos, the sun remains a brilliant reminder of our connection to the universe. Witnessing a sunrise or sunset, remember the long lineage of humans who revered the sun. The sun is the heartbeat of our solar system, a beacon of inspiration shaping human culture for millennia. Scientists aim to learn more about the sun through space missions and advanced telescopes, 
Understanding the sun's behavior is crucial for predicting space weather and protecting technology. Missions like NASA's Parker Solar Probe and ESA's Solar Orbiter capture unprecedented data. These missions are vital for our technology-dependent society. Solar storms can affect GPS, communications, and power supplies. The future of solar exploration promises scientific knowledge and practical applications. As we look up at the sun, we look forward to incredible discoveries driven by human curiosity. Imagine a world where the sun, our life-giving star, starts to move closer to Earth. The first signs would be subtle yet ominous. The sky, once a serene blue, would take on a harsh, glaring brightness. Daytime temperatures would soar, making the hottest summer days seem like a cool breeze in comparison. Plants would wither under the relentless heat, struggling to survive. Water sources would begin to evaporate at alarming rates, leaving lakes and rivers dry and barren. The air would become thick and stifling, filled with the scent of scorched earth. As the sun's proximity increased, weather patterns would become chaotic and violent. Massive storms, fueled by the intense heat, would ravage the land. Hurricanes, tornadoes and thunderstorms would become daily occurrences, their destructive power amplified by the sun's oppressive presence. Human life would be pushed to the brink. The scorching temperatures would make outdoor activity nearly impossible, forcing people to seek refuge in whatever shelter they could find. Power grids would fail under the strain of constant air conditioning, plunging cities into darkness and chaos. Crops would fail, leading to widespread food shortages and famine. The very fabric of society would begin to unravel as resources became scarce and desperation set in. The once vibrant and bustling world would be reduced to a fight for survival against an unyielding enemy. In such a scenario, the sun, the source of all life on Earth, would become a harbinger of doom. The delicate balance that sustains life on our planet would be irrevocably disrupted, leaving humanity to face an uncertain and perilous future. As we explore the mysteries of the sun and strive to understand its behavior, we are reminded of the delicate dance we perform with our star. The sun giveth, and the sun taketh away. Our quest for knowledge is not just a pursuit of curiosity, but a crucial endeavor to safeguard our very existence.